deberías aprender español ahora. For anyone who didn't understand that, you should get to know more about the Spanish and the many levels there are. Señora Anki is a skilled teacher that has been teaching for a long time. She teaches many classes and many levels of Spanish. More students take Spanish than any other language. And here today with us is the main teacher for Spanish at ASD. Okay, I'm here with Señora Anki to tell you about Spanish. The first question we have is, how long have you been teaching Spanish? All in all, I've been teaching about uh, 16 years. It's a lot. <laughs> yes, I taught in Peru, then in Texas, Malaysia, and now Qatar. How many levels do you teach? Presently, I teach Spanish A, Spanish B, and Spanish D. Okay, and how many classes do you have, including all the levels? Uh, five classes. Two Spanish A's, two B's, and one D. Okay, and... What kinds of projects do you guys do? Oh, a variety of things. We have oral projects, we have written projects, we have electronic projects um, for all kind of learning styles. Do you have many tests? At the end of every unit, yeah, students have tests and usually covers the different skills that we language teachers teach you. Uh, for example, you have oral assessments to uh, to see how you're speaking. We have writing assessments, we have reading assessments, we have listening assessments. So, a variety of them. And which levels learn the most? Like, not necessarily the amount, or the amount of learning, not necessarily the level of learning. That's a tough question. Uh, I say all levels learn, but the to get the basics as to how the language works. I think Spanish A students uh, learn more terminology if you want to. Mm -hmm. Now this year I have my D level, uh, Spanish D level, and I think these students are increasing a lot in terms of vocabulary mm -hmm. and uh, have a lot of opportunity to practice the grammar structures that you have learned in A, in B, and C. Some of them have skipped C, some they haven't. At any rate, uh, it's just a great opportunity to put all your knowledge in, yeah. into practice. But you always are increasing in terms of vocabulary and uh, other grammar structures like adverbs and uh, learn more pronouns and adjectives, etc. So you get a wide range of, so I say A and D. Probably. Okay. Yeah. And is Spanish class you'd recommend to all the other students that don't take it? Oh, absolutely, yes. Please do take a language. <laughs> we live in a world where learning, knowing another language, it's basic, it's a hallmark. Please do, it looks good on your records. Okay, well, thank you for joining us today, and that is learning about your electives with Senor Anki. Thank you. As you can see, foreign languages are almost core classes here at AC. Spanish is a class bustling with lots of hard work and learning. Thanks for joining us today to learn more about the Spanish. And a special thanks to Senora Anki for sharing with us today. Adios.